Tonight, a Chicago woman has a warning about riding your bike on the lakefront. Here is the area we're talking about as seen from Chopper 2. She was riding along and took a tumble at this drop off point. She is now paralyzed from her ribs down and she's making it her mission to make sure others do not suffer the same fate. Suzanne Lemignot has the story in this original report. Jennifer Kraft says she was an avid biker, hiker and skier. Kraft says on April 25th, 2014, a typical lakefront bike ride at dusk left her paralyzed from her ribs down. I looked up and I saw the path that it, it was continuous and the next thing I knew I was down on the ground and I had no idea what happened whatsoever. Kraft says she didn't know the breakwater wall she was riding on ended, sending her crashing to the ground. I had landed on my helmet. My helmet totally shattered and I had like blood coming down like into my mouth and then I, I realized right away that I couldn't move my legs at all. The high school chemistry teacher had been biking north on the lakefront about six blocks south of 31st Street Harbor. And when you saw that it was a nine foot drop. I, d I was just happy that I still have my life. Kraft says she's now making it her mission in life to get a warning sign posted. I think it's extremely important that this never happens to anybody ever again. If there was a sign, I wouldn't have been on that path in that area. So I really want there to be a sign that says, hey, there's this drop ahead. Kraft posted this video on social media and started a petition. She's also filing a lawsuit. Anyone that would just go out there and look you would see, oh my God, I can't tell that there is this drop off and there but by the grace of God go I. And so I really hope this effectuates a change and some warnings. Suzanne Lemigno, CBS 2 News. And a spokesperson for the Chicago Park District had no comment.